Clombo might be coming to Lego Fortnite. Now today we got another teaser from Lego Fortnite about Tuesday's gardening or animal update, but then they dropped this audio cue. <laughs> Now, I don't want to say that we're 100% getting Clombo in this update, but according to this previous leaked image here, we do know that polar bears and Osiris cave types could be releasing in LEGO Fortnite. But we did get a live update here from LEGO Fortnite status, showing us that we are getting pigs to drop in LEGO Fortnite. Now, it's especially hard to dismiss this as not real because we do have that roadmap leak that we just talked about that shows that Clombo is in a LEGO version in mid June into late August. So again, this means that he would be coming extremely early in comparison to what the roadmap says, but the roadmap was a complete guess and could have been a fake leak. So we're not 100% sure if this is Clombo, but when I show you guys these audio bites, I know for a fact that a lot of you guys like myself and my discord are going to believe that this is definitely Clombo releasing into the game. <laughs> So just right there, I played you a BR version of what Clombo sounded like when he was in the game. And then I showed you the original clip that Lego Fortnite teased to us today. And what you guys were able to hear is that the sounds are nearly identical. Now, again, this does go to show that it is very likely that Clombo could be coming. However, the way that I looked at this originally was that this could just be a bear as we did have those polar bear leaks talked about in the past. Now, if you're not sure exactly what Clombo is, this is the trailer for when he released inside of Battle Royale. Now, the way that Clombo works is he's actually a friendly creature as long as you're giving him food. If you attack him, he gets angry. If you attack him, he charges at you. But if you feed him, he actually gives you epic or rare loot. So it does look like if he's coming into the game, this will be a new way to get yourself some loot, give you a new way to go ahead and farm items if you make him angry like a brute and have him attack towards you. But overall, this is going to be extremely, extremely nice to drop into LEGO Fortnite as this could be absolutely game changing for every single one of us. Now we could absolutely be looking too deep into this, but when when you watch this villager go ahead and sit down and then hear that audio cue, it doesn't look like they're scared of anything, which could obviously mean that that is Clombo, who is known as a nice creature in the game. Whereas if this was a bear, you would think that this character would obviously be a little bit more scared, maybe run away or at least be frightened in some way, shape or form. But the way that this looks right now is that they're not scared. They have all of this stuff at their village, but there is no bear that is coming by to destroy their village or do anything crazy. So I do think this is Clombo. However, I do think at minimum, we'll be getting bears into Lego Fortnite, which again is just going to make things a lot more fun. Now keep in mind guys, this is just a few teasers that they gave us, which doesn't include obviously giving us the entire update. We still do have another day until we get the patch notes for this update to know absolutely every single piece of information that is going to be releasing inside of Lego Fortnite. But from the trailers, different things that we got to be able to see is new hanging upside down lights and different builds or chairs that come from creative mode over to survival. Outside of that, the builds look like nothing new. The silo was created out of the new sidewalks that were added into survival mode. This chair that she's sitting on in this clip right here looks maybe like an emote. And a lot of the stuff that are inside of the game don't look very brand new as far as the building aspects of this game. However, we do know that you can get something crazy to release in the game very soon. Hopefully that means new fences, new builds, and new items to keep now around your village just in case we do have bears in the game that look to come and destroy some of your farmland, scare some of your animals, or terrorize any part of your villages. Now, I am bringing up the roadmap one more time. As we see in the month of April, this is that April update that is on the roadmap. 
Fortnite Festival did release a brand new green logo or theme for it, which obviously does hint towards the Billie Eilish releasing. And we know that on May 3rd, we are getting that Star Wars content. So as long as it matches up that image, it'll look like this roadmap is actually accurate. As far as the combo leak that is part of it, like I said earlier in this video, we don't know 100% if combo is coming. We do know that a new animal is coming. We do know that it sounds like a bear or combo is going to release into the game. So the way that I'm looking at this right now is if combo comes, that is absolutely awesome and almost goes to show that this roadmap probably is real but if he doesn't come we still have until mid june or july for him to release into the game and at least we're getting some sort of new animal to come into lego fortnite which any new content is good new content now guys regardless of if all of the leaks from the roadmap are real or not knowing that we're getting new animals tomorrow or on tuesday i mean and then getting that star wars update on the third it looks like lego fortnite is finally back for those that left because because there wasn't a lot of content. Now we have a ton of content releasing into the game just in the next two weeks, which means that now every single one of us has so much stuff, not just to do when the updates come out, but so much stuff to do before the updates come out. So I hope that all of you guys are as excited as I am for this update when it releases on Tuesday, the 23rd. The server should be down around 4 a.m. and back up by 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So until that comes, we have a lot of preparation to do. Now, when we get this update, guys, everybody needs to keep in mind when stuff like this releases, the servers are typically pretty bad. We get a ton of people that return back to the game, and I believe that that just kind of makes the servers a little bit crazy because there's too many people on them for what they expected at the time. So if we do get Clombo into the game, expect a lot of people to join back onto the Lego Fortnite grind and expect the servers to be pretty rough. Even just with new animals releasing, the servers aren't going to be the greatest of things tomorrow unless they mention inside of their patch notes that we are actually going to get some server maintenance as well. So when you guys go ahead and you get online on Tuesday, expect the servers to be a little bit wacky expect things to be a little bit glitched or bugged but on wednesday they should have hot fixes ready to go that'll fix every single one of those issues i hope that you guys are as excited for this as i am i'll be live every single night leading up to tuesday and then again on tuesday preparing for this event and getting everything that i possibly can ready for when this releases into the game so if you guys aren't preparing grab as much wood grab as much food seeds vines and anything that animals in the game would like to eat that way you can bring them back to your village area and then hopefully house them and keep them for easier materials and items so hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and as always guys this was crafty i'm out peace